Welcome to News 3. I'm Kurt Williams. Topping our headlines, Norfolk police say a man is dead and a woman badly wounded after a shooting. This happened on Hibby Street in the Campostella section of the city. Police say this was a domestic related shooting and the victims were found inside a house on Thursday afternoon. The man died at the scene. Police say the woman is in serious condition. State health officials will open nine new community COVID-19 testing centers across Virginia. Governor Northam made the announcement Thursday afternoon. Two of the centers are slated for our area, one in Norfolk and one in Newport News. The new testing centers will help support locally coordinated community testing events. According to Northam's office, the first community testing center will open January 8th at the Richmond International Raceway with eight additional sites opening in the coming weeks. We'll be sure to update you when the new Hampton Roads testing centers will open up. Time now for a check on your forecast with Chief Meteorologist Patrick Rocky. Well, hey, Kurt, and that forecast does include rain and maybe a little bit of snow for some of us overnight. It is not going to be much, but as we take you through the evening hours, we're going to see some showers developing late and then some of our northern locations on the northern portions of the Middle Peninsula, the northern eastern shore. We could see a little bit of snow and then tomorrow morning we're going to wake up to dry conditions and dropping temperatures and increasing wind. So it is going to be blustery around for tomorrow. Windy, very cold temperatures in the upper 30s. By the afternoon, a lot of us will drop pretty close to the freezing mark with wind chills into the 20s. Look at that, a high of around 38 degrees by Saturday afternoon. Plenty of sunshine around. We do warm up significantly on Sunday to around 60. Some showers move in late day ahead of a cold front. If the colder air comes rushing in before the rain moves out, we could see a brief change over to some snow on Monday morning. And look at the high on Tuesday, just 32 degrees. That is a look at your first warning seven day forecast. We hope you have a great evening.